Greetings, you two. Danny Staten here. On the Danny Dan blog. I'm in the woods in Winston, South Carolina. Near a place called Spivey Point. A place I've been to many times. Right near here, about three miles to my right, is where I made that video called Where Was the Winston? Where large hairy creatures were sawing the woods. This morning, some kids... On, honestly, we were cutting class from school and stuff like that. They took a shortcut down one of these places where these power lines are. You know, these Bigfoot highways, I call them, where creatures use these power line passages to travel around without being seen. And these kids said as they looked into the woods to their left, they saw large hairy creatures, three of them, in the woods running. They didn't say if it was Bigfoot, Dogman, or Wolfman, or whatever. They just said large hairy creatures. The minute I heard about it, I hear sirens in the distance. The minute I heard about it, the Danny Dan was on the scene, on the case, because I hadn't had hardly any Bigfoot or Wolfman or Dogman sightings or anything in the last three weeks. But today, I've got two in the same day. Yeah, there's a weird-looking thing on the ground out there. Something did come through here. Oh, what the hell? I just saw something down there. I don't know what that is, you do, but I don't know what that is. Do you see what I see? I'm not saying it's a large, hairy creature, but there is definitely something moving down there. Too far away, it's probably a hundred yards. A hundred yards away. It looks like it's... I don't know. thought I saw something move down there. Well, i tell you what. Daily Dan's going to head down that way and see, what, see if he can find some sign of what I just saw down there. I, I'm not going to say that was a large hairy... I'm not going to say that was a large hairy creature or something, but I did see a shadow something moving down in there. Could have been a deer. Could have been a hunter. Could have been anything. But as I get closer, I see some large yellow looking shit down in there. Earlier, I thought I heard something walking in the leaves, but I never could see what it was. Daily Dan has to say, it feels good to be back out in these woods on an adventure, on a mission. Looking around, seeing if I can find something out here today. Maybe today will be the day I get lucky and actually catch something on video. You don't never know. As always, be sure to let me know in the comments below. If the comments below show up, because YouTube sucks. Let me know in the comments below if you see anything the Daily Dan misses. You know, now that I've got down in here a little bit, I can see something on the ground right here where something has traveled through here. Can you see that, YouTube? even though I prefer to keep my shadow off the video. Did you hear that? 
weird air top sound maybe. I don't What an eerily quiet place. You know, I've been here quite a few times on investigations in this general area, as it seems to have a lot of activity. Look at that bent tree right there. Whoa, weird. Weird, weird. And in the middle of this dense forest, in the middle of this jungle, I see a big yellow motherfucker laying over here. Uh. I've been heading for it for a while because it stuck out like a sore thumb in here. Today would be this yellow container. In the middle of nowhere. Don't make no sense, really, for this to be here. Huh. It's obviously been here for a while, but it makes no sense that a yellow container like this We'd be in the middle of these damn woods. Very creepy stuff. Weird, not creepy, but weird. These kids sighting is about three hours ago. As I was, took a while to get down here. So it's highly likely whatever the kids saw had long gone before I made it down here. Cigar. But I was at least hoping to catch some evidence. I haven't been able to find much. I'm kind of the leaves. It's like a carpet on this forest floor today. And I'll have to say that I keep coming up on these walls of priors on this side. If you come in from the other side, it's probably point. Because I'm on the opposite side of where I normally come in if I come in this area. And it looks like if over here is kind of a wall of briars and thorns and stuff. Really different than the three or four miles away where I normally come into this area if I did come into this area. I've never been in this particular place right here. I don't think. Way further up than I normally am. So as always, be sure to let me know if you see anything in these videos that I miss. Be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. And I'll be back on further adventures and further investigations here on the Daily Dan Blog. And until next time, this is Danny Staten. Thanking you for joining me on my little adventure in the deep, dark, dank woods today. And until next time, this is Danny Staten saying, blog over, dudes. Blog over.